Hi boys and girls. Today we're going to do an art project. Um, we, you can either paint this art project or you can use uh, colored pencils or crayons or markers, pretty much whatever you have at home. We've been talking about invertebrates in science, so I thought we could draw an invertebrate. Today we're going to draw a mollusk. Do you remember what a mollusk is? And we're going to draw something that you might find outside in your backyard that is a mollusk. Can you guess? We're going to make a snail. Let me show you how to make a snail. You're gonna need a couple things. I have a piece of beautiful watercolor paper, but if you don't have watercolor paper, that's okay. You can just get regular paper, or if maybe mom and dad have some watercolor paper, they could let you have some. You could start with a pencil, and after you draw your lines, you can go in after, and when you're done with the pencil, whoops, then do it with marker. And then you remember how we do that, then we erase the pencil line. But today, I'm just going to start with the marker because I think it's a little easier for you to see. All right, here we go. Let's make a snail. The first thing that I want you to do is I want you to start at the top of the paper and make a great big six, a big fat one, kind of like that. Then you're going to keep going and stop. Now, if that was hard and you did it with a pencil, you can erase it and try it again. Once you have that done, you're going to bring the shell down, kind of to where the ground is going to be, and then you're going to make a little bump and finish off the shell like that. So this is the snail shell. While you're working with me on this drawing project, if you need to pause the video so you can get caught up, that's okay. Have your mom or dad show you how to pause the video, and then you can do this by yourself. The next part of the drawing that we're going to do is we're gonna make the body of the snail, okay? The body of the snail is soft and squishy, and he comes out like this, and then his tail comes out like this. You can see how he kind of hides up inside the shell in the middle. Now we're going to put his antenna. I'm gonna put one antenna here. I'm actually gonna color in his antenna. I like it to look like it's in front. And then I'm gonna put another antenna here, sort of on the back of his head. I want him to be a happy snail. So I'm gonna give him a little smile. How's that? Good. Now my snail needs some ground so it can walk. And I'm just gonna put a horizon line behind him. Pretty simple. And then maybe a cloud up in the sky, and how about some sun peeking out from the cloud? And that's it. We have our snail. Now the next step is going to be, if you have your paints with you, you can paint the snail. If you don't, you could use colored pencils or crayons or markers. I'm gonna just get started painting and I'll let you finish it at home. You can make a snail shell just about any color you want because snails come in lots of different colors. What if today we made our snail purple? Remember, water, towel, lightly touch the paint. And so I'm gonna go around and around and around when I paint, but I just decided since I'm using a small space, maybe I'd be better to use a small brush. And I'm gonna give my shell a little bit of purple. And then I think I'm gonna change color. Water, towel, lightly touch the paint. And I think I'm gonna change to blue. Now I'm gonna let you think how you want your shell to go, how it could change colors as the curls around. Maybe from blue, it could go to darker blue. I'm going pretty fast because I want you to be able to see this on the video. Of course, you're, when you're doing this at home, you're gonna do it much slower. And then maybe I'm gonna change another color and go with a darker purple. Ooh, that looks pretty. Okay, I would, I'm gonna leave the shell there and let you think about how you wanna finish that. I would make the grass. What color do you think the grass is gonna be? Green, of course. And I'm gonna bring that in right like this. Okay, go around the snail and I'll let you finish the grass. And then of course, what color is the sky? It's gonna be blue. I'm gonna use my big brush for blue, if you have a big brush. If you don't, you can use a small one. 
and then the sun can be yellow. And there you have it. You have made a mollusk. Bye-bye, boys and girls. Remember to thank God out loud every day. Bye-bye.